Hey guys, it is finally Halloween season, meaning candy, scary movies, corn mazes, ooh, and haunted houses, visiting the local morgue. Just kidding, don't do that. Um, and lots of fun stuff, creepy, cold, yummy. Mm. Anyway, I'm excited for it. That's why I'm showing you guys how to get this cool, fun, scarecrow look. Super simple. And so, thank you guys for checking it out. If you guys like it and want to see more, then please subscribe. That way you can support me and check out future videos. Because I'll have a lot. And they will be cool, hopefully, in your opinion. I don't know. Anyway. Really easy, scarecrow, or voodoo doll, rag doll, I don't know. There's a lot of different things you could call this. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Let's get started. So I've already done the base of my face, or my foundation, and now I'm just showing you guys how I went about getting my eye look, but you don't have to copy that. And I'm just using the... NYC palette in Animal Instinct and it's got some great fall colors. I'm using the orange on my lid and the dark green in my crease. Then just blending all that in. Now I'm doing a fun cat eye. And this eyeliner kind of sucks so it's a little bit messy looking. But yeah, this um, the second line in there, you can see it'll blend in with the lashes that I add later on. But I wanted to show you guys a couple different ways of going about getting the eyelashes. So right now I'm just showing you guys how it looks with the falsies, which have that separated sort of look, kind of like um, if they were sewn on type of look that we're going for. Now I'm just putting some foundation on my lips and we're going to be drawing on the mouth. And I'm using a cream liner by LA Colors and drawing a circle. And it's okay if it's not perfect at first. If you're using a cream liner then you can just kind of blend it into the blush. Now I'm using a blush stick by Maybelline and then adding some shadow to it to even out both sides, adding the stitches. Now I'm doing the nose because I didn't have like an orange, a burnt orange color, I just mixed some dark foundation with a corally colored lipstick. Now I'm drawing on the bottom lashes. Next, I am doing the patch on my forehead, and I'm just using a dark foundation and then going to be setting that with some powder. And then I'm using a duo color stick by LA Colors and just using the dark brown and the light brown to create that burlap sack type look. Adding in some stitches, and now just adding on those drawn lashes. So you can decide which um, which lashes you like better or if you like both. I personally like both actually. And that is it for the face look. Now I am just really super quickly braiding my hair and um, kind of pulling it out just for added effect. And then I found some twine and just added that to the ends of my hair. So this is the final look and I just got the shirt from a thrift store and threw on some jeans, some boots, and a hat and found some corn in my house and put that in there since I couldn't find straw. So if you can find some straw and maybe some overalls then you'd be really good to go. And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you guys have a fun and safe Halloween. Bye!